Hey everybody, Chris back with you again, and in this video, I'm going to talk about the application that goes with the SanDisk iExpand Flash Drive 3. Now, if you didn't catch my previous video about how to free up space on your iPhone, I'll leave a link in the description below, or you can check out the card if it shows up, like right around here. So, tonight, what we're going to talk about is the actual application and how to use it and some of the features of it. I probably won't go into it extensively, but I'm just going to show you a few basic things, so let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you do is you want to open up the application. And this is what the icon looks like right here. So we're going to open that up. When you do, you get this little demonstration. And it tells you to plug in your sand disk. So that's what I'm going to do. So after I plug that in, it thinks for a moment. And then it takes you to inside the, uh, inside the application. So at this point, I can copy files, I can view files, I can back up and restore. When I go to copy files, I can copy files from my phone, or I can copy files from the drive itself. So I can actually put the, the files or the photos back onto my phone from this as well. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm just going to take a couple of pictures and bring them down to the, uh, the flash drive. So copy. Uh, remind me later. Okay, so I've got some similar pictures here. I've got that one, that one, and that one that I'm going to just copy. And so I just selected those three, and I hit Copy to Expand Drive. It's asked me where to copy them to. I can create a folder if I want to, but I've already got some folders out here. So I'm going to just take it to Photos, and copy here, bam. Now, it also gives me the option to delete them from my phone if I want to right away. So I'm just going to say do not delete. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take those same files and I'm going to copy them from the expand drive back to my phone. So you do it in a very similar way. So there's Hugh Jackman with some nuts on his chin from the movie 43. There's some badass dude, Steve. And I will, let's just take those two. So then I hit copy to phone. And it says they've been saved to my library. So that's how you copy them from your phone and to your phone. Now you can go here to view files and those same folders are are showing up as you can see right here so if I go to photos I can go through my photos and pick the ones that I want to view it generates thumbnails if I want to drill down even more I've got the option of choosing audio video um, right now it's on files, so audio, video, or just uh, pictures. So if I just pick pictures on this filter, it's just going to show me pictures. So that is, now, now if I switch this over to here, it'll show me what's on my iPhone as well. So just a very intuitive app, I think. Um, you can also back up and restore. I can back up and restore my photo library. I can. The, another interesting thing it does is that you can actually back up your social media to this drive. So if I connect my social media to this, like Facebook, I can take all the photos on my Facebook and I can put it on this drive. I can also back up and restore contacts if I want to. I apologize if, you, if this is shaky and out of focus. But yeah, so so just a very intuitive app. It is really easy to use and it is very uh, quick. I think the other day I copied 916 files from my phone to the drive and it took maybe five minutes. So it, it works on the uh, USB 3 platform. So that is... Oh, 
uh, before I go, before I tell you that that's all, you also can take pictures directly from this app. And any picture that you take from this app will automatically be put on the drive. Just a very cool, just a very cool app. So that is it. That is the basics for the iExpand flash drive app. If you have any questions, let me know. I'd be happy to answer them. If I know them, I'm still feeling my way around this app, but that this will be the solution for me when I'm out in the field to throw down any photos off of my phone so I can make more room. I hope you've enjoyed this. If you have, give it a like and a thumbs up and get out to explore. We'll see you later. Peace.